A Miser and the Villagers Once upon a time there lived a miser One day a son was born to him This made the miser very unhappy Now all the villagers will be coming I will have to give a feast to them They all eat so much What should I do Oh now I have an idea Five villagers came The miser made them sit on the floor. Miser said loudly to Dinu, his servant, "Dinu, place a plate before everyone." "Yes, master." He placed a plate before all of them. Every plate had just two laddus. Seeing this, the villagers said, "Sir, is this all? Shame on you, rich man." "Nothing to worry, brother." Today we are supposed to play a wonderful game. I know you are surprised to see just two laddus in each of your plate. Well, as soon as you eat both of them, we shall serve you another two. And when you finish those two, you will be served two of more and so on it will go. On the other hand, for every laddu you eat, You will be paid rupees 10 but you must eat the laddu without bending your arm at the elbow and without putting your mouth to your plate now you may please proceed how can we eat without bending our arms he is making a fool of us even we cannot put our mouth to the plates he is a miser he has played a trick on us to save his money Miser thinks they won't be able to eat anything. <laughs> Listen to me carefully. I've got an idea. I understood how we can eat these. The villagers whispered into everyone's ears. <laughs> Let them whisper. They can eat because there's no way they can eat without bending their elbows. All of a sudden, oh my god, what a trick. Villagers have sat in a circle and without bending their elbows, they were feeding their neighbor. So they ate and ate. Stop, stop. You have eaten enough. You have already taken so much. At the end, almost each one had at least 60 laddus. My stomach is full. and i have earned rupees 600 also i have earned rupees 550 i could earn only rupees 580 oh this is terrible i tried to save money and ended up paying out so much amount